All right, so here we go with round one, and fear is not a factor for him. He feels so confident in all of his skills. Reference in the tail to take DC. He's got the reach advantage and certainly made good use of it there in the landing matchup. Just missed with the straight left hand. Big punch lands through the middle. Lands a big right hand early. Oh, straight right. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the kick. Oh, and there's a takedown attempt there, DC. I'm no analyst, but that one was pretty telegraphed, not his best effort. Yes, he may as well have sent a text message to his opponent saying, I'm going to shoot the moment the fight starts. Of course, he got defended. Set up your attack, young man. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very busy. Moreno gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Oh, thought he might have had that hit kick, but just out of range. Big roundhouse attempt, just misses. He loaded up on the other two. Watch the strike. So we pull up the numbers here. 28 total strikes have landed for Tim Ellen. Good punch land. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Keep going with that. Just misses with the straight right. Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. Just over two minutes to go in round one. And that one certainly found the target. He missed with that jab attempt there. Series of strikes for him there, staying busy and staying accurate. I mean, the accuracy is unbelievable. Beautiful head kick. Kick to the body by Ellen. Oh, stuffs the takedown without issue. Jockey in for position in the clinch. Both fighters here trying to get a more dominant position. Oh, big shot lands. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Whiffs on the right hand. He is all about that left kick to the body. That kick blocked by the assassin baby, Brandon Moran. Well, the right hand has been there at times, not that time. Real nice body kick. Oh, that's a nice strike. Oh, that, I'd probably dislocate. Whoa! Dude, oh. 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 Moreno's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of struggle. Beautiful kick. Rips the body there. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. Round two is next.
Are you ready? You ready? Fight! Effective punch there by Moreno. Oh, that strike is blocked. Straight counter, is it? And he caught the kick. Oh, nice counter punch there as he continues to make good use of this advantage in reach. Over and over again, big body kick. Just misses with the jet. We'll see what he can do. Elliott gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. He counters there with a jab. Potentially a critical takedown here. Back to the stand-up now. Both fighters upright. Oh, slips to avoid the right. Oh, lands a stiff punch there. Nice connection. Oh, nice man. Right hand punches the clinch. Elliott gets the tie clinch here. Good right hand from the top. Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. Goes back to that left kick once again. Effective jab there by Brandon Murray. Just over three minutes to go now. Nice punch lands over the top. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively, protecting his head, raising the guard, and really frustrating the offensive fighter a little bit. Lesson one in boxing class, hands up, chin down. Real sneaky body kick. He has a commitment to kicking. And it shows. Good shot there to land the takedown. Nice shot by Elliott. He got his foot on the hip, and now he's throwing up a triangle attempt. He's going to try to move his left arm across to get pressure on the choke. Fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Under two minutes to go in all second round. Oh, nice job here staying busy off of his back. Nice offense from the block. Moreno's lower jaw is extremely swollen now. Close guard. Moreno's looking to pass from full guard into half guard here, but he's denied. Hey, hey, well, no problem getting inside to land that straight punch. Oh, he might be out. in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Just misses with a left hook there. That was a nice play. Able to check that kick as well. Big body kick land. Thirty seconds now to go in the round. We need to get a takedown to win the round. Takedown attempt late in the round, and he gets it. Working off of his back here. Looks like he may try to hip escape. All right, dominant position here. He's got the full mount. A lot of different ways he can go here. Maybe try to find an arm bar. Just get the ground and pound. He can't attack submission, but those submissions will present themselves 
once he is landing that brutal ground and pound he is known for. Because then his opponent will start to get a little bit desperate to get out from under him, which will then in turn leave arms dangling, or he'll turn to his knees and get choked out. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed a seminal blow in that round. It was accumulation of those strikes. He kept hitting it over and over to the head. Eventually, he found the, the one that really did damage his opponent. Are you ready? You ready? Fight. Here we go. Five minutes remain in the fight. Ball lands another shot to the body, beautifully placed as he continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Moreno gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. All right, let's go. Let's get those hands going now. Just out of the range with that right hand. And he landed the right hand there. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Well, he continues to offer up the kick here, but just misses with that one. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got it. in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Oh! Good right here. Just out of range with that right hand. Elliott's kick attempt there blocked. Full guard now, DC. And for the guy on top, he needs to build posture or just go to the next position, start shoving that knee through, trying to get the half guard, which in turn will lead to... Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Elliott gets stung by that leg kick. And that punch no good. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Some nice back and forth action here. Kick to the body now, that one won't land. And just misses with that big right hand. Oh, and there's a kick to the body, not having that one blocked by the assassin baby, Brandon Moreno. Look at the turnover in that kick. Changes his stance. You'll see a lot of this from this fighter. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, oh. if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand, jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit, finish him off with the uppercut. You knew if he landed that weapon, 
happened repeatedly. It could be a short night for his opponent, but that was just one perfectly placed strike that his opponent candidly didn't even see coming. It landed flush, and the rest, as they say, is history. Big knockout win for him here tonight. So a huge result and a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the big knockout win. That could hold up as one of the better KOs of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, one second of the third round. Playing the winner by knockout, Timothy.